another satisfied customer. But you know what the problem with this was? Why he had a bad rating? Yeah, he likes to fart. I mean, what can I do about it? I can't do anything about that. That's why he has a bad rating. One, he likes to fart. And number two, he likes to listen to YouTube videos out loud. I think that's why he has a bad rating. My friend's $264 and now I gotta go home. But look at the timing. Look at Ontario Airport. Hey Uber, why aren't you showing me Ontario Airport, little punk? There we go, that's more like it. Ooh, 45, that's not bad. Look at the timing, my friends. Look at the freaking timing. God damn it, it is 7.30. That means I'm prime time and I can get a ride going home. Fingers crossed. You see the secret for today is right here. The secret is right here, look. Right there. The perfect timing. Boom, boom at four o'clock, $60 with a tip. Boom, boom at 6.30, waiting at John Wayne Airport. And now I'm at Ontario. I should be able to land another 20, 30 bucks going home. The secret is timing, right place, right time. Remember that. Let's study this together. $54 at 6.35, right now if you look over here, the time is 7.36, so it took me exactly an hour, I'm making my video, right? Now, let's go down a little bit. For 43 miles, I got paid $54, so that's good, that's one to one ratio. Is he gonna tip us? Um, not with a 4.55 rating, right? But this is how we roll. We don't get tips on all of them, but I took this ride even though it's not towards my house. Like, let me show you where my home is now. From here, my home is all the way up here. Look, I have two choices. Two choices right now. I can sit at Ontario for a little bit and get a ride home, or I can keep driving, sleep in my car, and in the morning go back. You didn't think about that one, right? Let me show you how far home is. Let's see how far home is. Ooh, 85 miles. Okay, what does 85 miles means from here? 85 miles basically means that's about $5 gives me 20 miles, $10 gives me 40 miles. So 20. That basically means I need $20 going home, my gas is paid for. That's it. So I'm not greedy. If from Ontario Airport, I can get roughly $20 going that way. It's enough, and then I can use destination mode to go rest of the way home, right? This is how we roll, my friends. This is how we roll. Now, I want you guys to pay attention to the mileage over here. This morning, I started. I've done 283 miles. Right now, I'm at $264. 20 miles is basically me going out not getting anybody. So this is one-to-one -one ratio, right? Did I get lucky? Mm -hmm. Yes, possibly I got lucky. This is literally the video of me picking him up and working in the background earlier on YouTube and I was describing stuff and then boom, the ride popped up and I took it. If you watch the last video, you'll be able to see exactly what I passed on in order to get this $50 ride. Actually, I loaded it for you because it was one out of five, one out of five, one out of five. That's when I realized, hey, go over here. That's when I realized, you know what? Right now, Uber is gonna give me a good ride because I'm one out of five in everything. Hey, go over here. I'm one out of five, one out of five in everything. Hope you like my style of video editing, my friends. Now, we're gonna turn the app on and go to Ontario Airport. I think I'm already in the queue. Hopefully, you get something going home. One hour and 41 minutes. Not bad, not bad. That means I'm milking it today, milking it today. Am I, oh yeah, I'm pretty close to being in the queue right now. And I'm not gonna eat any food right now because if I eat food, I'm gonna get sleepy. So literally, I want like 20, 30 bucks going towards my house. Hopefully, it's not gonna take too long. It's 7.45, I'll give it till about 8.15. I'll give it 30 minutes because I, I wanna rest. I've been driving all day. Once I get the money or the ride that way that I want, then halfway, I'll get some food. The cool thing with Ontario Airport is you don't have to go into the the prison, right? We can sit here and we can wait. Now it's just a waiting game, right? I'm noticing where I'm sitting. 
there is a lot of Uber drivers right here. And I'm right next to a place called Mr. Fry's, man. I'm thinking, you know what? I don't think it would hurt to have fries. Yeah, this is gonna take 30 minutes. I think I'm gonna get some french fries. French fries to eat. But then the problem is I get sleepy when I'm driving home. Part of me thinks maybe I should use uh, destination mode and just start heading home because it's 7.45. I can get home by 8.45, 9.15. That's still reasonable for me to get home at 9.15. Damn it, sometimes the hard decisions. What would you guys do? Let's look at the details together, right? Take a look at how long I've been driving today. Look at that, I've been here online for 13 and a half hours. I've done almost eight hour day, right? That's solid. 10 trips, which is the max I like to do in a particular day. Would you stay or would you start getting going home? It's 90 minutes to go home. It's 90 minutes to go home. What would you guys do? The money is pretty good. You know what? I'm gonna give it 12 minutes and around eight o'clock if the queue's not moving then I'm just gonna go home, use destination mode. Because I'm hoping somebody needs a ride on the way if I get 20 more bucks. If not, it's okay. Remember, my budget today was 150 to $250. I've met it. I've met it, so this is bonus. Anything I get right now going home is totally bonus. And we got a couple of comments we can respond to. Why don't you do Lyft also? I like this guy. You know, uh, Gio, Gio Ferrari, I thought he was a troll. And I gave him a hard time in the beginning. Now, he actually saved my butt yesterday. I put a video up about uh, some stuff going on at LAX and he's like, bro, take that off. You're risking yourself getting deactivated. And now we're friends and I'm gonna respond to him. I like him. Now let's respond to this troll. BMAC6730. Number one, the way you can tell it's a troll is like this. Look, they got the 67 three zero next to them they don't even know how to create a handle right like all my channels have a handle aa creation 911 right x serve there's no 1986 next to it right let's read what he has to say first bro works 87 hours in one week to make 1500 that's a joke and so is any rational argument for it you made $17.24 an hour and destroyed your car to do it. I guarantee you put 2K miles on your car in one week. He's absolutely right. I do put 2K miles in my car because that's one of the videos that I put up. But you know what's funny is they take my income, like 1,500, they divide it by the hours that I made and come up with 17.24. Now, that's still not accurate. I actually make nine to $10 an hour because of the insurance I pay, um, you know, the oil change, the tires, and the amount of hours I drive. So he's wrong. It's not $18 an hour. I actually make nine to $10 an hour. But what he doesn't understand is I'm working on my YouTube channel. Now watch my response. Now let me read my response to you guys. Cause you know, cause it's fun. It's fun dealing with trolls. We'll hide his face real fast. Thank you, brother. I appreciate that you called me bro. By the way, 17 an hour, your math is incorrect. I actually make nine to $10 an hour. Once you calculate the insurance, tires, oh man, my you know, voice to text is not always right. But basically I'm telling him and being a little bit smart with him. You guys can read it if you want. If not, I'm gonna upload this video and get ready. Let's see what's happening with Uber in the background. Oh, it's moving, good, good. That's another trick I have. By the way, I work in the background and then when I pop back, I can actually see Uber change and that's how I know that um, you know the queue's moving. If the queue's not moving, I say deuces. Oh, this is a cool one. I saw somebody the other day complaining about driving eight hours being too much and I laughed at them and asked them if they're new to the job. See, this this is cool. It's like, it's almost like people on my YouTube channel are commenting. Some are backing me up. Some are clowning each other. Um, I like it, man. This is fun. And now I've responded to everybody. If you look over here. Oh, let's go back one. If you look over here. Responses with new replies done. If you look over here. Oh, no, this is everyone I've responded to. And if you look over here, I haven't responded to. Everyone's done, I'm all caught up. This is why I like my smaller YouTube channel because I can stay on top of it. 
Did I get any more followers? Yeah. So I started today with 390 followers. 406, that means that's another 16 that gets added. So I'm averaging around 20 followers a day. This feels good. This means all the hard work is paying off. Now let's look at the videos, see if the videos are doing any good. Anything going viral? Nope. Nope, 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 nothing. But you know my end of the night review videos? Um, they tend to do decent. They get around 155 views and look, 18 comments, right? So I'm gonna do another one tonight. And the way you can tell it's the end of the night is everything has a thumbnail on it, except for at the end of the night, I actually show my ending, right? So when I show the end and I do something with a, with a red and an arrow, those videos tend to do a little bit better. I think the red catches people's attention and the 1,513 catches people's attention. Like, let's go back here and see anything is doing well. Oh, this one's not. See, here's another one. See, on this one, I didn't use red. But look, 22 comments, 315 views. So it's weird. It's the videos at the end of the night that do well. And if you watch this, you can literally see me, me giving feedback. Oh, here's another one. Yeah, you're right. No, I'm right. This is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. Trying to see if anything really picks up because if something's over four or five hundred, that means that video did well and I need to create more like that. I hope you guys aren't bored when I'm showing you my YouTube stuff. You can let me know because I want to turn you guys into content creators. There's a red one here. I'm trying to get it to get. Oh, here's another one. So for some reason, this one got views but no likes and comments. Second passage today was at 80. 30 in the morning for twenty dollars. I don't know why that got oh because it's short. See look, it's five hundred and ten minutes. I mean five hundred and ten duh. Five minutes and ten seconds. Here's another one. This one. Oh my god, this one doesn't even have a thumbnail. Oh, because I said please share this with the okay. Look at the title. The title is please share this video with a lawyer or a judge, right? It's gotten 31 likes, 32 comments, and 840 views. Just because of the title, because it doesn't even have a thumbnail on it. Now, this video deserves a thumbnail. Here's the one I'm talking about. Um, oh, yes. This is the one I was trying and I'm hoping that gets to 1,000 views, right? 29 likes, 16. Guys, if you want help with your YouTube channel, I'm a phone call away. $35 an hour and I can help you grow. Let me prove it to you. If you look at my main channel, I got this one to 34,000, oh, 33,000 followers, right? And look at the numbers it does. Right here, 139,000, 139,000 views in a month. Look at this, 21,000 hours of watch time, right? If you compare it to my current one, okay, and even, um, here, I'll show you one more thing. If you look over here, Look, I'm bored, I'm wait, waiting here. It gets around 650 subscribers a month. That's more than what this channel is getting right now. And if you go over here to see the numbers, watch. This channel is way, way little. Look, 49,000 views, which is good. But look, it only gets 1.K hours of watch time, but it is a new channel. This channel is not that old. All right, guys, I'm gonna call it a night. I'm gonna check, it's eight o'clock. I wanna see if the queue is moving. Oh, it's moving very slow. Man, I'll give it another 15 minutes. 15 more minutes, but I'm gonna upload this video, then I'll do one night recap video and you'll just know what I ended up making. God bless you, have a beautiful day. Thank you for liking and commenting. And remember, without your liking, without your comments, without you sharing my videos, I'm nothing. And my goal is very simple. Bring value to you, teach you a little bit of how I drive and how hard I do it so you don't have to do it. Seven days a week, 12 to 15 hours a day so I can stop driving Uber. And when I stop driving Uber, I'll create more content and I'll teach you how to be a blogger, a podcaster, and a YouTuber. Corona, 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 20 bucks. You know what? I told you guys I'm gonna take 20 bucks. I'll take 20 bucks, this gives me money, then I'm going home. And I know Corona is a little bit backwards, but the 20 bucks is what I wanted because that gives me gas money, right? Otherwise, I have to sit here, oh, bastard. You saw how fast I clicked on that, right? You guys saw how fast I clicked on that, right? But that's okay, maybe something better is coming. 20 bucks is all I wanted. Get me 20 bucks, gives me gas money, then I go home. All right, God bless you. I think my turn's coming up. When it starts popping like that out of queue, um, that means my turn's coming up.